Now we're going to be discussing the lunar rover on Apollo 17, or in fact, in any Apollo mission. But we're going to concentrate on 17 for now. So I'm going to read this one little paragraph here. It said, how the communication worked. Antenna on the lunar rover. The LRV was equipped with a high gain directional antenna that was designed to transmit data and video back to Earth. This antenna, although directional, could be kept in a general direction of Earth by relying on a tracking system that allowed for some compensation as the rover moved. So now let's go over here and have a look at the rover diagram in NASA's little PDF. I'm looking at all of the hardware on this tracking system. I can't find a tracking system here for starters, but it says figure 4-7 pointing high gain antenna. So I go over here and I'm looking at this and I'm looking at all the parts down here and up here and here. Oh, wait a minute. Let's just do one better. Let's go to the parts list and we'll have a look at the parts list. Now let's open this up and let's have a good look at all that listing there. And it gives you all the little pieces and parts here and over here tells you what they are. And it says, this little toggle here was set at launch in a folded position, and this is to actually grip. This is a handle to grab so that you can align the dish manually. Then we look at this alignment lock nut right here. Well, if they're going to put a motor in there, the motor on a dish goes right up here, and it sticks out this way, and there's a worm gear inside of here. I've set up a few of these dishes in my time. Not the rover, but just the standard 20-foot dishes. Well, I don't see any motors here. There's no motor in the list. This is just lock nuts and the wire going up. You will notice that the hills match the Apollo 17 footage and pictures. So this rover was from Apollo 17. And he's asking for information on, well, how do you know that? Well, I'm going to match the hills for him. But my point is, is that these are the kind of guys that will come up with all these silly documents and they have nothing to back it up with because when we pull the originals up we notice that the rover doesn't have any motors no tracking system that was the apollo 17 rover that i was just showing you where's the, all of this tracking stuff where's the tracking hardware where's the motors where's the control wiring there isn't any 